We're talking about heartbreak and healing from heartbreak. What's the Christian perspective on that? If you know, um, heartbreak is a universal experience. It transcends cultural, religious, and social boundaries. As Christians, we are not immune to the pain of shattered relationships, betrayal, disappointment. In a world where loyalty seems like a scarce resource and lies pervade relationships, navigating the terrain of love and trust can be incredibly challenging. However, as followers of Christ, we are called to find solace, strength, and healing in his teachings and the wisdom of scripture. Now let's talk about understanding heartbreak. From my perspective, heartbreak is a complex emotional experience characterized by intense feeling of sadness, grief, rejection, and disillusionment. It often arises from the betrayal of trust, unmet expectations, or the loss of a significant relationship. In today's world where fidelity is undervalued and deceit is prevalent, the risk of experiencing heartbreak is actually very, very heightened. Throughout the Bible, we encounter stories of individuals who experience profound heartbreak from the betrayal of Joseph by his brothers to the agony of David over his son Absalom's rebellion. I'm very sure we know the story. Scripture provides insights into human experience of pain and loss. However, it also offers hope and guidance for those who are hurting. In Psalm 34 verse 18, we find assurance that the Lord is close to the heartbroken and saves those who are crushed in spirit. This verse reminds us that God is intimately acquainted with our pain and suffering. He is not a distant observer, he is not indifferent to our struggles, but offers comfort, healing and restoration to those who turn to him in their distress. Similarly, in Isaiah 41 verse 10, God declares, So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. This verse reassures us of God's presence and His promise to sustain us through life's trials, including the anguish of heartbreak. Now, as Christians, our faith offers a pathway to healing and wholeness in the aftermath of heartbreak. There are some principles grounded in scripture that can guide us through this journey. First, you need to acknowledge your pain. It is essential to recognize and acknowledge the depth of your emotional pain. 
pretending that everything is fine or suppressing your feelings will only prolong the healing process. Take time to grieve the loss and allow yourself to feel the full range of emotions associated with heartbreak. 2. Seek God's presence. Turn to God in prayer. Seeking His comfort, guidance and strength, pour out your heart to Him, knowing that He hears your cries and understands your pain. Spend time in His Word, meditating on verses that speak to your situation and offer hope and encouragement. Extend forgiveness, right? That's the next step to, to healing. Extend forgiveness. Forgiveness is a crucial aspect of healing from heartbreak. While it may be difficult to forgive those who have hurt us deeply, Jesus teaches us to forgive others as he has forgiven us. Matthew 16, Matthew 6, sorry, not 16, Matthew 6, 14 to 15. By releasing bitterness and resentment, we free ourselves from the bondage of unforgiveness and open the door to healing. After that, you need to guard your heart. Proverbs 4, verse 23 tells us, Above all else, guard your heart, for everything you do flows from it. Be discerning in your relationships. Set healthy boundaries and exercise caution in whom you trust. Entrust your heart to God, allowing Him to protect and guide you in matters of love and relationships. Embrace hope. That's, that's the, the final step that I'm going to give him. Embrace hope. Despite the pain of heartbreak, we can cling to the hope that it is found that is found in Christ. Romans 15 verse 13 assures us that may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Trust that God is working all things together for your good, even in the midst of heartache and uncertainty. Now, after going through heartbreak, how do we give love another chance, right? Because in this in this world, you you are not an island. But after going through this, most Christians will ask, most people will ask, how do we give love another chance? But the idea of Opening oneself up to love again can be daunting. However, as Christians, we are called to love others as Christ loves us. That can be found in John 13, verse 34 to 35. Well, here are some steps that you may consider as you navigate the prospect of giving love another chance. First, you need to heal and reflect. Take time to heal from past wounds and reflect on lessons learned from your previous relationships. Use this season of introspection to grow in self-awareness and identify areas of personal growth and development. All right, don't just jump from one relationship to the next. Take time to heal 
and reflect. And then you need to pray for guidance. Seek God's guidance and wisdom as you discern the possibility of entering into a new relationship. Ask him to lead you to a partner who shares your faith, values and commitment to living according to his word. Build trust slowly. Right? Don't just throw your trust at anybody who, who smiles at you. Right? Trust is earned over time through consistent actions and mutual respect. Approach new relationships with caution. Taking the time to get to know the other person and allowing trust to develop naturally. You need to be able to communicate openly, right? Honest and open communication is essential to building a healthy and strong relationship. Be transparent about your expectations, boundaries, and concerns, and encourage your partner to do the same. Then you need to lean on God. Ultimately, the, the ultimate source of love, fulfillment, and security is found in our relationship with God. As you navigate the complexities of love and relationships, rely on Him for guidance, strength, and wisdom. Now I'm about to conclude this video. Heartbreak is a painful reality that many of us will face at some point in our lives. However, as Christians, we can find comfort, healing, and hope in the arms of our loving Savior. By embracing His teachings and trusting in His faithfulness, we can emerge from the ashes of heartbreak stronger, wiser, and more resilient than ever before. As we extend grace, forgiveness, and love to others, we reflect on the transformative power of God's love in our lives and offer a beacon of hope to those who are hurting. Please and please, do not give up hope. That's it for today's video. I hope you found it encouraging and uplifting. If you did, please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more faith-based content. Until next time, remember that you are loved you are valued and you are never alone. God bless you.